Hi friends, this is Carmen. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, first time here, welcome. My channel is all about succulents and cacti and houseplants in an apartment setting. So if that's something that interests you and you want to learn some more about, please make sure before you leave the video to hit that red subscribe button down below and the bell notification so you don't miss any of my videos. And if this video brings you some value and you like it, make sure you give it a thumbs up too. Okay. Today I have a subscriber mail unboxing. I've had a PO box now for a couple of months and I went uh, yesterday and picked up some boxes there. So I'm, I have opened them just to make sure that there weren't any plants in there that needed to be you know come out really quickly but i've left them in there because there weren't any plants like that in that uh, scenario so stay tuned and i will show you what i got let's get to it Okay, so I do have a P.O. box that um, subscribers do send me, you know, thoughtful things, whether it be plant cuttings, plant rooted plants, um, gifts for me or for Rosie. And I am so, so appreciative of that. Um, you know, it really, really warms my heart that you are sharing those things with me. And today I wanted to show you what I picked up. So the first one, I wasn't expecting this. This it's in a tube like thing and it's from Amanda from Fall River Massachusetts so thank you Amanda and let's see there is some packaging here it is here and it looks like it's a test tube like a um what do you call it propagation test tube hello and it looks like it's magnetic now there's some, see that? There is some literature here and a little note. Make it my glasses on. And it says, hello Carmen, I hope you and your family are well. My mother and I enjoy watching your videos and we came up with this idea and I thought you might be interested in it. Uh, we greatly appreciate your feedback on the product. Oh. Wow, and I'll list, um, they have an Etsy shop, and I'll list that down below, and it is called Takenoko, and it gives you instructions here on how to set it up. It is a propagation station. Oh, it slides off. Let's see. Let me take this off. Oh, I see. This is magnet. Ooh, wow, that is magnet. Oh, Break it. So it slides off, and you put it in a window glass. So you put this piece and this piece and a window in between it, and then you put your propagation right in here. That is so cool. I will find, and then it sticks right on there. I will find. The perfect spot for this. I'm not sure if I'll put it in a window, but I'll find something to put it on. Thank you, Amanda. I will definitely try this out and let you know how I like this and how it's doing for me, but it's looks like it's made out of bamboo. Really nice. A nice logo on the back. So that's really nice. Thank you so much. I appreciate you and your mother-in-law thinking of me for that. Now the next one I knew were coming. These are some aloes I was expecting uh, from Jennifer in uh, East Point, Florida. She wrote me just a little no. <laughs> uh, I'm not gonna read all of it online, uh, but it basically talks about the aloes that she sent me. These are soap aloes, and there is another name for these. Um, and I'll put it on the screen here. I think they're, they're Maculata uh, aloes. I'll put a picture in the name here. But uh, they're referred to as soap aloes. And these are pups off of her large one. And she says that these are basically indestructible. Um, very, very easy to care for and give off lots of pups. So these are nicely rooted, very healthy looking roots. And I will get these potted up 
and show you at the end where I have them. I, since there's a couple of them, I may put one outside in my balcony and one inside uh, my home. Uh, she mentioned that hummingbirds love them, so that's great because I have been wanting to um, attract hummingbirds to my balcony. Now, the next one I got is in a um, Bed Bath & Beyond box. So I was like, ooh, Bed Bath & Beyond. <laughs> so when I opened it up, first of all, the aroma is wonderful. She says, oh, and it is from Juliet in Scottsdale. So she's my neighbor, Juliet up in Scottsdale. Says, sorry, it's not bed, uh, Bath & Body Works. Uh, I said Bed Bath & Beyond, Body Works, Bath & Body Works. Hope you're not too disappointed, which I'm not. I'm sure whatever is in here is wonderful. And whatever it is, it's soft and it smells wonderful. And it's very nicely wrapped. Oh my goodness. And it is a, like a chenille. Oh my gosh. And it smells, he excuse me, heavenly. <laughs> and I'm wondering, I'm thinking that she probably knitted this herself. It looks like it is a handmade piece. I'm thinking, you know, it's big enough that you can do a, a bath mat, but I don't want to put this on the floor. Maybe put it on a chair or something like that. It's beautiful. Thank you so much. There's other things down here. Oh my gosh. There's, here's a card. That's what I was. Uh, Carmen and Rosie. It's for Carmen and Rosie. Oh my gosh. And, and it's the Union Jack. Um. Uh, the English uh, flag. Just know I'm an angle field. Oh, so pretty. Look at that car. So pretty. Oh, wow. Juliet, you have spectacular writing. It's Carmen and Rosie. Weather is, uh, even though the weather is, uh, warming up thought rosie may be may like oh i'm all right. it's hard to read with the marker which kept your weekday for our body oh for rosie okay you so much for both Rosie and myself. Thank you, Juliet. Okay. Something wrapped up here. Ah! <laughs> she heard me. She watched the video where I had a um, metallic thong tongs um, to hold on to my um, cacti and the, the metal was cutting into the cactus. So I had mentioned that I need to get ones with rubber on the end. Thank you so much. I appreciate that. This is perfect. Thank you. I am set. Little one, big one. For those big ones. And look at that. These two. Oh, wow. Thanks so much, Juliet. Exactly what I needed. One more here, I think. Oh, now these are uh, salad ones, but you can use these too. I love that. So I have a choice that I can uh, use any one of these tongs. Big one, little one, metal one, salad one. Thank you. And I think this little wrap here is for Rosie. There's another one in here. I think is for me. 
I think it's going to be, oh my gosh, it smells so good. She must have put some perfume on it or something. And I think it's going to be perfect for me. I love, love the color. Thank you so much. And this is definitely handmade. So one for Rosie and one for me. Isn't that sweet? So nice. Now I have also a couple things from Target that I want to show you. I'll keep everything together. Now I was at Target. Um, I like going to the Target dollar spot. I think it's also called uh, Bullseye Playground. You know, the little dog Bullseye. Um, so, but I call it the dollar spot. And they always have things there anywhere from a dollar to five dollars. And they change it up every season. Right now, obviously, they have a lot of um, Easter stuff. They have a lot of wedding stuff. But they had some things for planting. And I got there a little late. I didn't get too many things, but I found these small little containers and they're like a ceramic. Open up so I can show you. And they have little holes on it so I can plant directly into them. This one has a terracotta feel. And see, this one has a hole too. And it's a ceramic feel, and it says, enjoy the little things. Isn't that pretty? Such a pretty color. And this will fit like a little two-inch pot in here, but since it has a hole, I can plant directly into it and not worry about it. And these were $3 for the pair. So I, I bought two. So it's $3 for the pair. And this one has a white ceramic one, and this one says... Uh, you feel like sunshine and it's the same as the other ones they have a hole in the center and you can pot directly into them and I think I might just put a couple of those um, aloes that I just got into a couple of these uh, the larger one may not fit into maybe too big for these but I thought these were just adorable three dollars for the pair um, I thought they were really nice now they had some other pots that I had seen but I got there too late and they didn't have them. So I'm going to have to keep an eye on them and um, see if they restock them or not. So those are the things that I got in the mail. Thank you, Amanda, uh, Jennifer, and Juliet. Thank you so much. I appreciate you guys so much because these things, you know, I didn't ask for them. But you, out of the kindness of your heart, sent them to me. And I really appreciate your sharing that with me. And you know, the hard work that you put into uh, making them and uh, sending them to me. So thanks so much, friends. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button before you leave. And I will see you in the next video, okay? I'm going to get out and do some um, plant shopping here soon at a couple of nurseries, local nurseries. So be on the lookout for those uh, nursery tour videos and plant hauls. I'll see you in the next one. Have a blessed day. Bye-bye now.